fat do I look next to Nick? Oh, I wouldn't want to say. But, uh, we can, <laughs> that's, we can... that's more on me than you. I think. Well, I think we... it's, it's a team effort. Hey, gang, welcome to a special damage open. We're back with the Toy Fu lads. This is Nick. Hello. And, and this is Matt. Hello. And uh, we've got yet more boxes to do for this year's <laughs> TF Nation. I think most folks are aware of Toy Fu who uh, already do TF Nation. It's the, uh, the toy stand who do the whole charity thing. But uh, would you like to elaborate on that a little bit for the, the purposes of the folks who might not know? We started doing Toy Fu in 2009. I brought up a whole load of toys and took them down to what was then Auto Assembly, bought a table, hoped for the best, and we raised another about £1,000 or so for uh, a children's charity called Mary's Meals, which we've been proud to support uh, for the last decade. Super weeb. In terms of donations, like most of the stuff we've got today has been given to us by uh, several folks sort of over the course of the last few months. Can people do that at the show? Can people bring along stuff they're not into anymore and perpetuate the charity? Yes, they absolutely can. We always welcome donations. If you have something to donate, we will find a place for it and we will find it a good home. And Toy Fu is one of the few stands that you can keep coming back to and there's always going to be fresh stuff there. But there's always room for more exciting new figures to, to find. Hell yeah there is. Shall we dive in? Yes. Yeah. yeah! So where does this come from? This was all very generously donated uh, by Phil Ayres who a lot of people in the Transformers community will know. Oh, what a legend. Yes, he's an extremely nice man. Okay. <laughs> we are talking boxes. Oh boy, is that Legends friggin' Armada Thundercracker? It is indeed. Whoa. The car exclusive. There you go, nice. That's one of the rarer ones, isn't it? That guy is ridiculously hard to find. You can't get him for love nor money. These two are Takara uh, Prime Legends gift sets. Ooh, this okay. is a nice one of like Cyberverse Commandos and Legends figures. Some of them have exclusive paint schemes, some of them have exclusive weapons. That's a tidy little set. Yeah, the Autobot set is really nice and the Decepticon set we also have. Now we're talking. Megatron knockout. Who's that? Is that Starscream up there? Yep, it'll break down in the corner there and that's an exclusive zombie cliff jumper. Very nice. That, the, that colour was only available in this set. Whoa, okay. And same deal with the Air Commander Vehicon. Is this the G2 Jazz? Is this sought after this one? I feel like it kind of is. People love Jazz. It should be. <laughs> this is a Combat Hero Optus Prime, and they just released a Combat Hero Megatron as part of Siege. Oh, so they have the, the so weird sort of yeah, green based on the unreleased um, Optus Prime in G2. So if you want the set, yeah, this chap. that's the only way to do it. You've got to go through toys. Well, or you can get the original unreleased GT figure. That's a bit harder. Yeah, yeah, that's a that's hard mode. Yeah. We have a boxed Sharktacon Megatron. Oh boy, this is a lovely. We've got a couple of friends in there as well. Oh, hello. Is that a Waspinator? Yep. Yeah. Waspinator and the other oh, yeah. Armada Starscream. Armada Starscream. So will those be sold as a set? Probably not, right? Well, they have, they're just <laughs> just in there to get them home safely. Beautiful. Ooh, Dark Steel. It's a lovely thing of that. Sort of swiftly forgotten that one, wasn't it? Yeah, Beast Hunters very much came and went. Yeah. Mm. Rhinox. Yep. Oh, look at his tonguey bod. Ooh. These guys have all fallen out. Oh, they are in there. <laughs> They're in there. And they've all sort of oh, yeah, they've, all, they've all bunched up behind the car there. <laughs> oh, boy. They're all, um, what a mess. <laughs> that, may, that may or may not be accurate come, uh, come to events. It's breaky Satan boy. Yep, big old predator so tall he's almost had his face cut off by the uh, oh, band at the top of the box. It's a big ass Voyager. This Whoa. is not just a uh, guy <laughs> because uh, we've packed his brother Redwing in there as well. The exclusive two pack. Yep, now we have the pair of them, which is going to hopefully make some Prime fan day. We all know this gentleman. He's a good, reliable, friggin' big Megatron. We love him. He's neither the best nor the worst, but he's all right. Yes, he's a nice big presence and a nice big tank. Beautiful. What's this dusty Revenge of the Fallen? <gasps> it's freaking Stratosphere! <laughs> yeah, right. I'm a boy! That's right, a through immortalised minor character, Stratosphere. Yeah, has he got the little baby Prime? He's got the little baby Prime in there with him. Uh, I'm going to have to take your word on that, I can't see him. That's fair, I think it's in his... It's inside his, his butt. Yeah. Okay. Skylinks? Sky, it's no, either Skylinks or Skystalker. I think it is Skylinks, yeah. Um, and is that a free and brawn I see? Last but not least, that's, is that Revenge of the Fallen? Or yeah, yeah. Revenge post Revenge, Revenge of the Fallen Nest, I think it was. <laughs> His well, entire Ninja Turtle looking ass. These two also came from Phil, they were sort of overflow. Incinerator, which is a kind of uh, Osprey type VTOL. That was a, a better shot. Yeah, interesting guy, sort of vortexy. He's got those ridiculous spinny hands. Big old rotor hands, they're obviously big fans of Cop Tour from the original GoBots. Fact. This looks like the bar at the end of the night. <laughs> Ravage and... Mac Rollbar Ravage. 
Just some randos, isn't it? Some rando scouts. Is there Ravage in there? Oh, it's a Legends one. A rare item amongst some garbage. Oh, another set of the old Predacons. Yeah, another, and I think these are a couple of recolors. Oh yeah, that's the uh, that's the blot, isn't it? Yeah, cut throat. Sort of star screamy. Ah, yeah, Generations Rat Trap. Yeah, now we're talking. Yeah, he's a beauty. Probably be a good masterpiece stand-in. He's about the right size. Oh, he's lovely. Look at all that mouth stuff. Mostly sort of Dark of the Moon stuff, isn't it? Yeah, it's that kind of era. It's mostly Legends and Cyberverse. And... These are like the little sets. There was the Shockwave that had like the add-on thing. And that was the um, sort of Arctic Ratchet survival thread. I have never seen that Dealing. before. It was only available in the States and it was like a Target exclusive or something. Yeah. Far out. It's a bit sort of Jason the Wheel Warriors, that, isn't it? It is, isn't it? Is, it? Yeah. The treads and the thing on top. Who's this? Is this a hound of some kind? What on earth is that? It looks very Rolling Thunder, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. Sort of G.I. joe -y. It might come with this dude. Oh, him! He's great! Little flack. I kind of want that. Baby Ironhide. Ooh, okay. Mini full trailer Optimus. Somebody's got to want that, right? That's got to appeal to somebody. I mean, what what you find nowadays is the Legends figures, people tend to really want them. The movie was over ten years old now. Yeah. This, somebody who was eight years old when the movie came out is now an adult. Oh stop, I feel gross. And someone will come along and see them and say, oh, I remember these from when I was really little. And we'll see them and say, oh these were from yesterday, weren't they? Yeah, I remember this from eight months ago. Yeah. Oh boy, so much gear. Let's do... Should we do one of those small boxes at the back? One of these? Yeah, that messy bitch there. These are some knockoffs that we bought that are so amazing, I needed to keep a set for myself. And we went out and ordered more, so this box is just more of them. This that's all knockoff. The yellow fella. It's the same set. Jesus Christ, I can't wait for this. You might have seen this about various parts. Oh, yeah. That's like the Power Ranger coloured Grimlock, isn't it? Is that oversized? Yes, it's about 20% bigger than the real thing. There's your Power of the Prime Grimlock boy. Oh, he is a fair bit chunkier. Every figure comes with, uh, I think that's Snarl Sword. So they've all got the same um, red glowy. And uh, Slag's gun. Cool. Oh, the pink slash. Oh no! Her head's off. We can fix it. No! <laughs> Before Nick sees. God, that's so good. Actually, the, and, the, <laughs> and the quality is actually really good on these guys as well. Yeah. The girls. These folks. These folks. They've got die cast parts as well. Ooh. So I think Grimlock's. Um, is it his bum which is die cast? Yeah. Die -cast metal bum. That's what they call me. Slug now? Are we calling him a slug? Blue slug. Blue slug. He's got again, blug. die cast legs. Nice. Die cast back legs. Scale. And we've got. I can really tell in the robot mode. <laughs> <laughs> uh, orange sludge. Oh, we like orange sludge. He's coloured like our life preserver. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, safety sludge. Safety sludge. Yellow yeah, well, That's actually really cool. Sort of a construction robot -y. You can feel how nice the quality is, can't you? Yeah, it's it's feels, real. It feels it's, like a real toy. It's really. It's nicer than the originals. It's really surprising how well they've made them. <laughs> Nick's going to be a hero and combine those while well, me and Matt continue to delve. Matt's got something in his bag. So every year we do a Toy Foo fanzine and this year the big theme is a MicroMasters. It's not been printed yet but I, I can send a few of the artwork and you can... Yeah, they yeah. Flash it up in internet magic. Da, 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 da. I'm doing it now. Two pounds for the fanzine, or it's free if you spend over twenty pounds on the toy food stall. And again, all the money from that is going to the charity Mary's Meals. On top of that, we've put together a profile book of all 140 MicroMasters. MicroMaster Encyclopedia. The Junior MicroMaster Encyclopedia cover um, by TMUK legend Matt Dallas. And oh, nice. Myself. I'm going to have to get a print of that. Hi. <laughs> Atlan is just Alan wearing a tie. The T stands for tie. The T is lowercase because by all accounts the tie is a bit rubbish. This is so English, I love it. And the last thing is... And the last location is Little Victories. It's a 256 page novel. What? An unofficial novel? Official novel. Oh my god, all about MicroMasters. It's got flat top in it, he's a main character. Yes! Uh, this one will be £7. And again, this is non-profit in aid of Mary's Meals. Matt Marshall, do I know that name? It's me. Oh. <laughs> Your favourite game? Oh no, Mystery of Convoy. But I know there's a massive internet fan base for this game because it's so great. It's, uh, it's certainly something. You want your hands free because you want to be stroking this. Jesus. <laughs> um, what am I looking at? 
It's Optimus Primal, but he's flocked. He's flocked? Like he's got fuzz? He's got fuzz. Oh my god, he's fuzzy. I told you, yeah. Oh my god, that's amazing. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. We have the technology to flock a Transformer, finally. That's something I've never seen before. No, exactly. Oh, fluffy. Oh, back to this. Cool. That is mega. <laughs> that is considerably bigger than the uh, friggin' Combiner Wars guy. Superb. You've got six of these. Yeah, everyone comes with a gun and a sword. Beautiful. So what's the RRP on one of those, dare I ask? They are 70 pounds on Sir Toys. Okay. And uh, because we bought several, uh, we are able to offer them for the same price. Oh, nice. You don't know what's in here. That's six dodge. The universe for the time Dodge rolled around. Uh, generations, I think. Yeah, so it was. Oh, yeah, 2011, 2012. Lovely boy. Oh, I love him. Cybertron Star Scheme that we've done as Thrust in the twin pack with the repainted Vector Prime. Chunky boy. <laughs> they did a version of that as Dirge as well, didn't they? And now that is. Love that him. That is the repaint of Signal Flare. He's harder to come by because that was towards the end of the line. Hmm, looks like Gut Cruncher. That's. Uh, hey, it's Thrust. Yep, classic Thrust. Yeah. Wait, not classics. No, that is generations as well. Generations it's a first again. Wave yeah. of generations, wasn't it? Overflow, overload, over, over... overkill. Yeah, but what's his name? In he had a different name. Come on, brain. Overboard. Overboard. Yeah, this is the, the hard boy to find. Oh, ha, 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 ha. Hello. All the generations, coneheads. Yeah, now this one is classics. Classics for sure. We also have, for some reason, the front car from the Decepticon anti-aircraft base from Micromasters. Oh, okay. Well, something in it. Combiner Wars Legron. Ooh, fancy. That might be the Takara version, because he's got a grey missile. Oh. I think he's a bit shinier than the standard version. God, he's an awkward sod, isn't he? Yeah. I mean, he's great. Buy him. Prime RC. Is that the, uh, that's the R.I.D. one, isn't it? Prime Robots in Disguise. It's, it all got very confusing for a while. Hey, it's Cybertron Unicron. Yeah, he's crop up every so often. They're, it's a nice sort of pointy crab tank thing. That turns into this horrible dude. Follow Cybertron Soundwave. Nice. Hey, he's got his mate in there. Yep, laser beak. Nice. This one has uh, seen better days, sadly, but this is oh, an Armada no. Demolisher oh. who's been. Demolished. He's missing his missiles, and somebody has helpfully coloured in his Decepticon symbol with a marker pen. So they have. <laughs> but. Oh, and there's his bonds. Oh no, what happened, mate? <laughs> He's been in some kind of food fight, it looks like. And, uh, oh, flip it out. Is that bomb burst? Yeah, it is indeed bomb burst. With, hey, uh, both, of his, both of his guns. Very nice. Yep. Is, the, um, is the shell in there? Who cares? No, sadly, no shell, but uh, the. And a robot is. Nick. Yeah, Bombus is one of the ones that actually looks like something when yeah. transformed. You might need to pixelate this for uh, content. Uh, <laughs> it's that like actual browning. It's the Microman version. It looks like it's of about the right vintage. Yeah, wow. Oh my god, don't break it. I'm going to try very hard not to. Funny how we always end up with a browning in these videos, isn't it? Uncanny. Yeah. Is that broke? Yeah, it's missing a piece of the. Uh... But the, but the, everyone I've seen has been broken in that same place. Hmm, they must have a common fault. Still though, pretty cool, right? It's incredibly yeah. cool. Yeah. So, <laughs> What's that? This is one of the chaps from Puzzler Fiend. Oh, the Gobot Baddie Combiner. That's the Gobot Monster Combiner. Show us what it turns into, Nick. Prepare to be underwhelmed. That's, <laughs> you can imagine that's some sort of intake or something. Sure, sure. Oh. Okay. It's weirdly similar to Bomb Burst, isn't it? They look like oh, yeah, actually. distant brothers. Snip the SR-71 lady from Gobots. From L Gobots. Mm -hmm. That's way cool. Oh, we got uh, the most evil Transformer ever hey, made. Hey, it's uh, uh, Spy Changer Scourge. Yep. Oh, Brill. Yep, he is. Um... What a motley crew this is. Browning. Oh, the blue leader one. Oh, hello there. Oh, no. Oh, well, that uh, at least in it the bin. came away quite easily, so it's uh, not, no more broken than it was. It's a small consolation. They've got a bunch of minicons we're hoping to pair either with the rest of their teams or with their partners. So we got a crumple zone here. Oh, uh, yeah, that's the guy from um, uh, Cyclonus. Yeah. yeah. Long arm. That's the one from Smokescreen, isn't it? Jolt. Know, yep, we all know Jolt. Spark plug. Spark plug, yep. Yay. Almost all. Of the uh, street speed team. Whoops, oh speed no! Action. That's the Perceptor gang, isn't street it? Street action team. Yep. Unfortunately, I didn't notice that uh, the back uh, section of the bike is missing, which unfortunately is the combined mode head. Oh no! So these will be available for not very much. There's a drum from the inside of the walking mechanism on an Omega Supreme, which has seen better days. <laughs> what? Scout cars from Overlord. Like you do. What? 
Yeah. From Overlord? Yeah, one of the Power Master dudes that raids in there. Oh, okay. So you get something to roll up and down all the ramps in the basement. That is the most random accessory. <laughs> Left Fist, a Devastator. I'll oh, put that okay. with our other enormous pile of uh, G1 accessories that we now have. Made a, a spreadsheet of them, I think we had yeah. 560 something. It's something like that, yeah. Uh, G1 Christ. accessories, so if you are looking for G1 accessories, do give us a shout. And whatever that is. Uh, come on, Nick, you got this. Come on, Nick. I don't think it's even from a Transformer, I think it's from some shelving unit. Like it was oh. Like <laughs> what have we got here? That's Megatronus. Megatronus from R.I.D. Mm -hmm. Got some fresh boys in here. <gasps> is that Beast Wars Neo Dead End? Yep. Yeah, it is. Clam face. There you go. Oh, wow. <laughs> Absurd. Squid pubes. Razor Beast. He's a giggle on his own. Ah, oh, we've got a little bag of GoBots. Can you pass them to me? Yeah, yeah, do you want to present? I'm going to have to pretend I know who they are. Um, I know who most of them are, so we'll be all right. That is Rest Cube. A one arm Rest Cube. We do have a really yellow one with another arm. The same blue eagle boy. Yeah, maybe a transplant can occur. Um, yeah, get both and yeah. Frankenstein a good one out of it. That's Turbo. Loki man. Is it Turbo? Yeah, that's Turbo. Is it? Yeah. Poor Turbo. He's not in great shape. Hey, there you I, go. I spoke too soon. A little floppy, but he'll do. In the 80s, everybody had one of these. Uh, this is a pull back and go. Jeep it thing. does look weirdly familiar. But Road Ranger? Is it? Yep. Yes! Oh, I'm so talented and attractive. What a walk! With his arm all the way out. Who am I, Phew? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh sure. my, now we're talking. I'm That's sure Crasher, we isn't it? Who Crasher is. Unfortunately, that's interesting, she's missing a wheel. I know I actually had a carded one, and the carded one was missing the same wheel. Oh, weird. People do love Crasher, though. I'm sure someone will have it. What do we have in there, Nicholas? RC Arms Micron, I think. Small Micron. She turns into a sword. Ooh. Pterodactyl car. Sure. That's got to be from some stupid bloody thing, right? Yeah. Put it down. Moving <laughs> on. Oh, I recognise that. Sky High or something. Sky Blast. Sky Blast, yes, yeah, from the Requiem Blaster. Is that one? Snapdragon? Yep. Nice. He's got his head. Yeah, we have how many Snapdragons? Five? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so we've got. Two or three sets of guns and... So casual about thing. this. Fire Convoy yep. of some description. Is it just him? Or yep. he got all his gear? We've got all his gear. Hey, nice. There we go. No missiles for the ladder, sadly. Ah, we'll live. It never ends, does it? A couple of crash combiners. We power glide and I think Skyquake, is it? Yeah, I believe that is Skyquake. This what one... What on earth is that? This one was a, a nervous passenger. This is... Oh my god. These machines... Night Scream, Scream isn't it? Yep. He is. What a mess. I barely really tell what I'm looking at. Just check out his hairstyle. Oh my god, he's got a little anime quiff. <laughs> he's gonna tell you all about his dark past. Is that oh, difficult to come by in such good nick? It's difficult to come by in tact, yes. Oh, I've never seen that before in my life. He has all his discs because he has a disc launcher in his chest. Ah, beautiful. Oh no! It's so here! <laughs> Missiles all over the shop. Optimal Optimus. Okay, and great. He's got his giant lesson. orange rifle as well. Yep. So, we're in good shape. What a bizarre mix of gear this is. Gobots, Diaclone, and then like, just Megatronus. Let's blast through this big, clear crate of whatevers. Let's just churn through these. Right, we've got Wind Charger, Alternators, Dark of the Moon Shark Wave. That's animated Retgar, we love him. Is that the first Ironhide? Yes, I think so. Uh, Cybertronian Animated Optimus. Beast Machine's Ultra Class Jet Storm has his chrome looking. Not bad, actually. Talker just about to see his tusks through the plastic mist. It's Voyager Animated Megatron. Retracts. Oh, he's got his instructions. Animated Grimlock. Very good. It's Universe Heavy Load. Ah, oh, Manterra, my boy. Armada Blur, I want to say? Yep. Is it? Yes. <gasps> Is that Elite Guard Bumblebee? Yep. Oh, cool. Red alert. Armada Wave 1. Very hard to come by. Not Mixmaster. Oh, he's a nightmare. Hey, I'm out of thrust. Big old bag of Beast Machines basics. Try saying that three times fast. Jawbreaker slash Cackle. Oh yeah, x brawn and Sideburn. Cybertron Soundwave. Yay! Everybody's got ten of those. Striker! Yeah, we love her. Ooh, Jetstorm. Uh, Beast Machines Jetstorm and... Uh, oh. Savage Noble? That's Megatron's discarded Beast Mode. I haven't watched Beast Machines. Animated Snarl? Not a rare item. Oh, it's um, Bone Crusher. What an absolute splat of a thing. Prowl. From R.I.D. The remaining Autobro. Is that Swerve? RVO Swerve? No, it's Cliff Jumper. 
Oh, no. Oh, no. Hey, Jet Blade! That's a really fun mold as well. It's not good, but it is fun. <laughs> Voyager Blackout. I can barely tell what's going on. Oh, that guy Sideways. again. Sideways. From a ladder. There's always one of those. Energon Starscream. Ooh, it's kind of a weird angle. That's that's his back. Yeah. His robot mode back. But that's Energon Starscream. He is good. Some um, Cybertron Basics. Oh, yeah. Uh, Backstop. I see uh, Ransack and Overhaul. East Wars Bone Crusher. Bisonman. Uh, okay. <laughs> I can barely tell. Oh, it's dead end. Oh, yeah. Skyhammer. Yep. Dark of the Moon Skyhammer. Injector. But he's so bad, he's cool again, isn't he? Yeah, he, he goes all the way past infinity and comes back around to being good. Ooh, Transmetal Scourge. This is one of my favourite, actually. Ooh, uh, some alternators. Shock Blast and um, Swindle. Swindle. Yep, Swindle is one of the most popular molds. I love that figure, Swindle yeah. Swindle slash Hound. Really good. East Rider. <sighs> What? Can we pop that one out? I've never sure. seen that. Look at these were stupendously unpopular back in the day. You don't say. They were a sort of little combat chariot for Beast Machines doctors to ride on. I gotta say, I'm not impressed. Nor was anyone else at the time, but <laughs> Oh, there's your lad. Mm. Has he got a Thunder Clash? He yeah. has. Alright, we're laughing. I'm out of Skywarp. Cybertron Thundercracker. Hey, it's um Blast Charge. Yep. Sidearm sideswipe. Energon. Freaking bags, man. <laughs> <laughs> They're just opaque in all the wrong spots. Hey! Oh my god, Energon Rodimus. Rescue Ratchet. Actual Armada Starscream. That's pretty good. Commoner Garden stack of standard old bots. It's kind of research, isn't it? <laughs> if nothing else. Pick up a few of these and see how things have evolved. We're getting to the good stuff now. We've got a uh, Toy Food special Japan auction thing full of mysterious wonders. <laughs> That's some manner of grandus. This is Doug Bass, or Dag Bass, depending on your preference. He's sort of the civilian edition of Grandus. He's got like traffic lights instead of gun turrets. If we do this, so he's got all the, the lift and repair arms Whoa. and things. And... <laughs> he's going. There we go. So this was from, I want to say Zone or Master Force? The original Grandis was from Battle Stars, which was the line that just came after Zone in 1991. Right. And this is a heavily remoulded version in Brave of Command Dagwon, I think was the series it's in. Command Dagwon. He pop off and it becomes a, a sort of four platform train station. <laughs> look at that. His eyes kind of look like the bridge of an aircraft carrier or something like that. Oh yeah, they kind of do. <laughs> there are some trains in the same line that uh, combine with him. Here's one. Are not combined with him, they interact with him. Okay. So this fella turns into a robot, and this part is part of his combined form as well. This was my personal favourite, that's the dragster. Oh my god. Um, <laughs> it's a dragster bullet train. Yep. Yeah. So that's also the uh, waste plate that holds the two legs together. It has that look so about it, yeah. The, that sits on this side. I'm pretty sure the third one is in here. Shall we come back to the third one once we've dealt with all this brilliant Gal Guy Gar stuff? Yeah, that's fair. So we had yeah. a couple of these guys last year. This is an actual proper combined form. That's right. We, we had, we had, uh, was it this very guy, the yellow one? You had the yellow one and we had the red one, which is sadly the two left hand sides. So they couldn't combine, the but that's clearly a, a cement butt on the go. I couldn't tell you the exact name of them. Somebody will know, I'm sure. That's what you go on YouTube for, isn't it? To get corrected. Pretty much. Who's that? That's part of the first Brave line. I'm looking to Matt for support. Matt doesn't know either. <laughs> I like his um, his little sash, his ascot. That's Cyber Beast in here. It's Dinobot. Check my here. But he's got a little mohawk. Yeah. Ha! <laughs> so his name is Cyber Beast, or is it's, he one of the Cyber Beasts? He's one of the Cyber Beasts. There are four of them, and this one is missing his uh, raptor arms. So it's probably not going to be too expensive. Nice. Um, but it might look better in robot mode. Cheapo broken dino. Robot face, which is a bit kind of terrifying. Oh yeah, and over here he's, he's got a robot raptor eye as well. God, that's righteous. I think this one is from Dinozaurs in the early 2000s. Dinozaurs. That's not Transformers, is it? No. I don't know what that is. It's kind of skeletal isn't it? Yeah, it looks quite nifty. Ooh. That's a translucent, oops, animated Optimus Prime who's just lost a smoke snap. Has it snapped? No, nope, no, it's just popped off. That's really cool, actually, like a crystal version. Yeah. That was a decent figure, actually, the deluxe one. Some very pretty uh, fish. 
little little scale or is that? They're all called something else. The gold version, leggy shark. Uh, do, 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 do. Just the three of those, is it? Um, I think it might be, yes. Here's another bit of go 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 friend that will pop on his arm. Great. Oh, Ooh, that uh, looks like RC. Is that the Japanese version? Yes, it yeah. will be. It's a Japanese box, so I think she's a slightly darker pink, more magenta. I'm sure she is, yeah. Here's the third train bro. Oh, nice. This one has apparently been through the jam wars. Is it rust or is it just muck? I think it's jam. Just... <laughs> He's quite well preserved. Hey. Oh. So are there four of those total? There is a fourth one that was sold separately. It was a kind of black steam locomotive looking <gasps> chap. That became a giant shoulder cannon for the combined form. <laughs> of course it did. Yep. Of course it did. Something. General purpose Sentai beaky raven thing. I don't know. This is from J Decker. That's the car. Oh yeah, ex brave J Decker. Yeah. I remember a uh, paper plane talking about that. Big old head in there. <laughs> is this part of a combiner? I think it is, yeah. It's gotta be with that head. And uh, he's, a, he's a regular robot as well. He seems to have lost a bit of his badge yeah, on so his forehead. Is. Which is That's a shame. alright, he'll live. <laughs> and this is a part of another combiner that I couldn't name without access to Phil Ayers' Brave book. I'm sure he'll be kind enough to let us know. General Maybe. fire engine lad. Easy to spot police car because it is almost entirely chrome. Oh my god. It just looks white. Oh, no, there it goes. Is that from Jay Decker as well, do you reckon? It's that sort of thing, isn't it? Ah, this is an actual Transformer. Oh, that looks like, oh god, a very, very yellowed, is that Siren? Or, yep. What was his name? Go Siren. Shooter. Go Shooter, that's right. Go Shooter? No way. Oh, hang on. Oh, there's more. Tiny little figures. Oh, I think they're from Doug Base. Nice, yeah. Yeah. Oh, they would go Doug with this guy. Yeah, so they're sort of little chaps to populate them. Oh, marvellous. Suck on that trip to come. I like little monster from my pocket, isn't they? Oh, like Mighty yeah. Max. There you go. Oh, that's fantastic. So you've got three trains, giant base with his <laughs> entire face, and some little blokes that go on it. That's a great set. And there's two of them! Another day in the life of Toy Fu that would blow anyone else's head off. This is from Go Go Andy Robo. So he's, he's drawn as a Cosmos? Yes. With the Toy Fu logo, well, that's brilliant. And, that and he sent me some um, DuckTales figures as well, which I was very, very happy about. Oh, great. <laughs> Random boys here. Cap Megatron, you've got to be kidding me. And the shoe, uh, the Mike. cap and shoe combo. Mike Megatron. And there's a couple of random parts of the Disney Super Sentai combiner. Oh, you're kidding me. So that's, we've got Mini, Pluto and Goofy. That's Energon Sharkticon. Oh, he's all right, isn't he? He's great. He's a good figure. He's a nice army builder. Just a really good, solid design. Revenge of the Fallen Sideswipe. Yep. Not a rare item, but not bad at all. Movie Bumblebee. That's the first original. movie Bumblebee. Hello. Hey, Barricade. With uh, Frenzy. He's one of the better ones. One of the original movie designs that's stood the test of time, I think. For sure. And we've got a bunch of G1 Legends. Goldbug. Up to the spring. Oh, yeah, those guys. No harm done. Uh, Beast Hunter's Abominus. Oh god, that guy again. He's, yeah. he's this year's Star Stable. <laughs> not as good. Not as grail-tastic as last year. Whoever what this the flip? chap is... No, he's folded up into some kind of... Um, uh, Alright. Like a tablet or a fridge or... I don't know. Yeah, some kind of magical gem fridge. Trying not to make this all about your pants, honestly. <laughs> Power core huffo. And they're all resting on top of the world's biggest bumblebee. Matt found at a car boot sale. <laughs> Here is your new child. He's mega, my god. I like how you were kind of holding it like a guitar when you did that. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> bumblebee! <laughs> Yeah, no shit. <laughs> yeah, Devon finds him so charming. He's massive. And like, really hoping a small child will love it and take it as a companion. But you never see these as well, do you? I've, no, I've never seen one apart from this one. They wanted £60 for them when they were actually sold on shelves. Uh, what did you get it for at the car boot? I'll rather not say. Two quid? It was a bit less than that. 20p? Oh my god, really? 20 yeah. pence? <laughs> I kind of want to fill it up with beans. Decepticons! <laughs> I disagree. What do we have in the bubble wrap? Oh, this is a couple of chums, also from Miyagi Japan. Ooh. Starting at the top. Got the small ones. 
We're up to the Japanese Tigertron. Oh, real. Seems to have been kept out of direct sunlight. Oh, nice. No, so he's still nice and shiny white. Yeah, the Japanese Tigertron was absolutely gorgeous. It was in very high demand even back in the day. And at the opposite end of the scale, we have uh, Shadow Panther. Jesus Christ, I can barely see it. Put a look at the uh, robot mode. There you go. Which has a bit more colour to it. And completing the trio. Straight down the middle, flipping Cheetor. Yep, I believe nice. this one is red eyed. Red eyed? Are there variants? Yeah, the Cheetor came in uh, red, green, and blue. People are mad for the variants back in the day, didn't they? That was the big thing, was the Cheetor eye variant, and now mm. people don't really remember it. Yeah, I, I didn't. I have no idea. No, he's got red eyes on the top, okay. but the figure actually has green. So confirmed for green eyed Cheetor? Yep. Cool. Oh. Good Christ. It's, it's the freaking taco tank. Box taco tank, you never see that. Was it even released in the West? No. No, okay. no I think uh, Hasbro took one look at it and said, some other time maybe. Yeah, we're good. I've only ever seen two taco tanks and they've both been in this room. <laughs> Has he got um, Icard? He does. Behold. Hey, there he is. Bloody thing. Ah, there we there are. There we are. That's better. So. Logically, pops out of here, and it comes a motorbike that car can sit inside. It's designed for him. Yes, it was designed for him, Nick. Mm, definitely, yeah, that looks really natural. <laughs> we'll be over here a second, so we're not like Nick's crotch the movie. <laughs> there we go. What an absolute mess. I love it. You might not know this, the inside of the box is a lovely seascape. Oh, nice. With uh, appropriate plastic pollution. Well, you keep telling me that it's rare, but you also keep telling me how you keep getting two and three every yeah, year. It's got magic. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but one off assembly, we came with 11 Avalors. Toy food rules are different to normal rules. And this is the final one for today. This is a very special box because this one's from me. Or more accurately, it's from you lot because this is all the stuff from Down I Open that I already had. Shall we? <laughs> There's, yeah, tons of stuff. Yeah. Should we whiz through yeah. these? Right. Mace Windu. Star yeah, Wars Star Wars crossover Mace Windu. Hey, that's uh, Titan's, not Titan's Return. Is yeah, it? it is Titan's Return. Titan's Return Voyager Optimus. I think his uh, yellow sword is in there somewhere. That's cool. Oh, there it is. Just next to that. Leader oh. One. Oh, Super Leader One. Yeah, no less. Oh, if you don't mind. Oh, beautiful condition. Yeah, he's good. Is it stickered up? It is. It, it's official. It's got the uh, got the repro labels on. Um, it's alternator wheel jack. He's got his original blue waist and pants and socks on, um, <laughs> but also he is green. Titans return, Power Master Optimus Prime. That's the boy. Lovely. He's got all his gear in the uh, in the trailer. Hey, universe. Tankor. Tankor. Universe Tankor, no less. Almost said Octane. Hey, Optimus Minor. <gasps> <laughs> the worst. I don't really know what that is. I think it's like an Armada Optimus, but I, I can never figure out how it transforms. This is Reveal the Shield Retgar. Reveal the Shield Retgar. And that's um, that's actually my one, because oh, wow. uh, I got the Power of the Primes one and it's better. Yeah, the thumbs tend to break because of the stress of the axe. Really not very well designed. <laughs> and handlebars, if you transformed it wrong, they would explode. Oh, great. So, in a way, a pretty solid homage to yeah. the original character. I suppose, yeah, he is rubbish. Some, some back guns. Yeah, someone gave those to me. I didn't know what to do with them. Oh, There's yeah. some cards. I think they're, they're like magnetized. So, yeah. you, if you that's roll a... them on, they, they like deploy. Ooh, that's right. They get magnetized auto transformation. I think they're really clever. Wow. They are quite good, yeah, but I just I had no idea what to do with them. That's Generations. The first Windblade, her sword is in there somewhere. Ah, there, it there it is. She's all right. Yeah. It's just, again, the Titans Return one is better. Sorry. I think it helps that there is basically a Windblade in every line now. That yeah. Hasbro gets a crack at refining the design every time. Thunder. Oh, I'm keeping that. Okay, that's but, a bot bot. That's hey. the um, Bond's eye, I think that is. Beachcomber. Beachcomber. Nifty. Construct bots. I think movie Optimus. So an original uh, Ironhide. That's a G1 Ironhide. Yes, hey. that's uh, that's my old one. Little, that's uh, chap from the Sports Car Patrol. Road Hugger, I think, or Road Handler. Oh, is this uh, one of the McDonald's? It is. That's McDonald's Beast Wars Panther. I've somehow I've, I've got like four of him. <laughs> Fair He's, enough. He looks a lot like Silverbolt, doesn't he, in the face? Hmm. I haven't seen one in many a year, so. Gratefully received. Yeah. Oh, well, that's part of uh, one of the Aqua Speeder. I want to say Drench Squirter, Squirty Boy. Oh, oh. look who it ain't. <laughs> Titans um, Kick. No, Scrap. Was it Titans he got? A... Okay. He got a re-release in yeah. the Titans. Ah, so. it, it's that one anyway. Cybertron <laughs> He's got all his gear, I think, nice. apart from the uh, maybe apart from the. Oh, I didn't know they did that. 
Yeah, there's a slot in here. I just learned something. This is a tiny, oh, it's a tiny double changer of Soundwave. That's right, that is Soundwave. He's one of the better ones. Is this an ARMS Micron Megatron? No, that's a Kinder Surprise Megatron. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Fall of Cybertron the Frenzy and or Rumble. I didn't it, want to see it in case it, it got It's the blue one, so in my house that's Rumble. Tentacool! Hey, Tentacool! Beast Machines Jet Storm. Hey. A second one. Ooh. That is the Age of Extinction release of uh, the Guile Dart Boy. Oh, nice. It's Slug. He's great. Carnivac. The central guy of Carnivac. It's a stapler. Stink Eye Stapleton. Uh, quite knackered Grimlock. I think his neck is broken. I'm sure we can uh, salvage them. Ooh. Speaking of which, yeah, that's my old uh, knackered old slag that I met on the internet. Are you noticing some uh, blue tack? Oh yeah, that, that was some of my ghetto repair strategies back in the day. Let's go. Technobot. That's the boy. Backstop. Is Another that the backstop. movie version? I think they're released Backstop and Recluse. My favourite iteration is the Windcharger. Now they reveal the shield. Reveal the shield. Oh, wind wind stacks. Hey. Super Gobot Stacks. Can't argue with that. We love him. Reveal yeah. the shield Perceptor. Yep. He is a pain in the ass. <laughs> I'm out of heart shot. Hey, we got a jolt from him earlier, didn't we? Yep. That might be the joltless one. And that is titanium yep. uh, die cast. War Within, Optimus Prime. I think he's customed a bit. He's got like some custom paint on. Yeah, looks like it. He's all right. I just I didn't have a spot for him in the collection. That's fair. Obi Wan. It's the same figure. I'm, I'm sure as the Mace Windu. It's yeah. the same guy. It's, it's not as good as maybe Dag Base or whatever. But it, it, it's something in it. But every contribution yeah. helps because remember all the all the profits from toy food go to Charity Mary's meals. So any any contribution at all is a net positive. Yeah, brilliant. Even if it's an Armada Hotshot. Oh, I love Armada Hotshot, it's on to me. All right, I think that's everything, isn't it? My God. It's looking that way, yeah. So thank you to the Toy Food Boys for having me. I hope you've enjoyed the show. We're going to be at TF Nation, flogging all this gear for charity. August the 16th at Birmingham Metropole. I've had a lovely time rifling through all this crap with the boys at Toy Food. I certainly hope you're in frame, I can't tell from here. <laughs> <laughs> Party on and such, and I'll see you on the next one. How about that? These I'm are sure. great. Yeah, the back again, they're all right. They're they? amazing. Yeah, they're clever. He's amazing! We've blown Matt's mind with Bakugan. Be sure to subscribe for more Thu's Awesome Transformers reviews. Limited appeal, keeping it real.